Oh, he's going. I just started again. Okay. Are you ready? Okay. Three, two, one. Showtime. Hi, I'm Matt Lister from What Pictures, and in the first episode of this series, I'm here to tell you why it's okay to be depressed. This one has made me question myself for a long time. Not recently, but I've felt depressed at times when I've had no reason why or any idea to be. I feel alone. I lose my appetite. I question myself. I get angry, and even though I want to try and reach out to my best friends, I feel like I'm really annoying them. So why? Why does this happen? I don't know. Why does it happen, John? Why is it happening? So in order to understand why it's okay, we first have to understand how depression affects the body physically. Turn the science behind it! In short, depression is a chemical imbalance in the brain. There are millions, even billions of chemical reactions that make up the dynamic system that are responsible for your mood, your perceptions, and how you experience life. You can't just snap out of depression. Stop trying to tell us to just get over it. It's not just a phase. I'm not attention seeking, you f***ing prick. I want to do things with my life. I want to go outside, but I can't. So what can you do to help depression? It's said that there are two effective treatments, medication and exercise. So medication, of course there's stigma about using medications to alter your mood, but apparently it's the most effective treatment for it. These drugs help balance the chemical imbalance in the brain. Though research has shown exercise is an often effective, yet underused treatment for moderate to mild depression. Improved self-esteem is a key psychological benefit of regular physical activity. When you exercise, your body releases chemicals known as endorphins. These endorphins interact with the receptors in your brain and they help reduce the perception of pain. Other things that are said to help with depression are dancing, gardening, and even going out for a walk. Matt, are you okay? Okay. So why is it okay to be depressed? It's said that people with depression are often more compassionate, less judgmental, better writers, and also generally have a more positive outlook on life when a bad streak is over. But also because it's human nature. Trust me, it's wired into all of us. Some people hide it better than others, but deep down we're all the same. We all worry about the same things. We worry about money. We hate our bodies. We aren't in or we're not getting along in our relationships. And that's okay, because it's human instinct to be dissatisfied. Even if you have everything that you've ever wanted in your life, there's always something that you wish you could have, which in turn brings up all these feelings and emotions that we feel depressed about because things aren't going the way we want them to. It's natural. Studies show that one in five young people will suffer from depression at some stage of their life, many before they reach the age of 18. And anyone watching who suffers from it and is having a bad day, let me tell you, it's going to be okay. It can only get better. It can only get better. There are many different ways that people deal with it. Some people go out for walks, some people surround themselves with their friends and family, and some people binge watch the latest series of Netflix. Hey Matt, you feeling better? There are so many different ways that people get themselves out of a slump and you've just got to try and find your thing that gets you out of it. Write everything down and share your thoughts anonymously with the world. Go and find someone to talk to either personally or professionally as there are thousands of services and people ready and able to talk to you. We've come across many different helplines and services. Any more that we find will be found in the description below. There's always something that you can do to turn it around. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, then just give it a thumbs up. And if you'd like to see more, why don't you hit the subscription button below. We'd love to hear your opinions on this topic and suggestions for any other topics we could cover in the future. I'm Matt Lister from What Pictures, and that's why it's okay to be depressed. I'll see you soon.